Hey guys, Clash with Cree here, bringing you guys another Fight Club War recap today. Uh, today we're going to be covering our war against uh, Humman, Humman, Hum, Humman, Humman. Let me take a step back here. Hamanaptra. Okay, that took a while, but uh, we're covering our war against Hamanaptra. Uh, good performance from them. <coughs> Decent performance. Uh, their Town Hall 10 slipped up a little bit. Cost them the war a little bit. Not really, but uh, um, we'll go through what they did to our bases. Uh, they didn't take out the top 9s. Um, and then on our side, you could see uh, cleared the board, missed 3 9s, 99, 99, 75 there, and 97. So almost a perfect war. But. Um, we're going to take a look first, starting off with Sub-Zero with a fresh hit triple on number 4 here. Um, good per good uh, good results from everybody, at least everybody pulling in at least one triple. Uh, and that was just great to see. Um, but we have Sub-Zero going in here. Uh, he's going to be bringing in a cold-blooded uh, Govaho. You can see he's uh, he sees that the queen's not too deep. He sees the CC is not... Uh, it's going to pull rather quickly, so he only needs that one golem to tank. And he actually has some bowlers in the CC for a little bit of range. Uh, you can see uh, poisons come down, and he's actually got four heal spells. So lots of heal spells here. Uh, Valkyrie's going to push right into that Tesla farm. Take, pick that up nice and early. That's always good uh, when your full health units pick up a uh, high DPS zone. Um, he's already at a heal down there, so that was perfect. So just optimizing his heal drops now. You can see a couple hogs are going to be trickled in on the bottom. They're going to go into that air defense. Uh, a couple are going to bite uh, some spring traps there in the room, the outside of this base. Damn, these mortars are making the scream shake. Uh, <laughs> you can see hogs almost go down there. Uh, misses the heal a little bit. But you can see um, a couple of Valkyries still up. He's got his queen up. And everything's just going to be powering through the remainder of this base here. Uh, hogs are going to wrap around. He's going to pop that queen ability uh Make a, a little bit less DPS, and he drops that last heal, making sure his hogs are full health as they take out that cannon. Probably could have swagged it, but uh, better to be safe than sorry. Awesome attack to Sub-Zero, and uh, keep up the good work. We'll fast forward this one as it goes through the cleanup, and then we'll head into our next attack. We will have uh, me taking out their number 5 with a um, stoned... Gobo drag. Uh, you can see the comp there, three golems. Uh, apparently, this is a forum base. I've never seen it before. But um, I'm going to take it out with a little. <coughs> a little golem, golem board dragon action here. We're going to push into the base from the bottom area, uh, creating a nice wide funnel. It's taking out all those buildings on the side. And bowlers are going to come up the gut here in just a second. You can see Golems already routing in. There goes the King, making sure the Golems take the aggro of the CC. You want the uh, King behind the Golems and the Golems to continue tanking for that CC. Uh, you can see King's taking a little bit of heat there, but he's fine. He's going to power into the core. Heal spell goes down for the kill squad. And uh, they're just going to continue rushing into the middle of this base. Uh, dragons come down from the top at this point, And the kill squad's working to grab that last air defense. It goes down. And, um... That's the end of this base here. You can see the dragons pushing in. Uh, two balloons in the bag. Those are going to be for that uh, exterior archer tower. Uh, queens in the core. Getting some tanking from the Golmites. And you can see all the dragons still up. Just overpowering this base. The rage spell just gave them that little bit of extra oomph that they needed to take out everything. Um, And the dragons continue their way around. Still got some bowlers up, two bowlers, kings up, dragons are up, queens up, and uh, golemites are still tanking. So uh, just ultimate value from those golems there. And um, just overall, um, very fun attack. I encourage you guys to try it. And uh, when the air defense are condensed up like that, or you can get a lot of value from those bowlers and just a couple backhand dragons. Uh, here's a nifty attack from uh, Poppy. You're going to see what I mean in a second here. Uh, he's going to push into this base uh, with a shattered Govaho. But you're going to see what happens here. A uh, little bit of a weird attack. Not the best base, 
but um, you'll see exactly what's going to go on. Bowlers come in there, Rage Bell goes down, Poison's on the CC, CC troops are going after his Barb King there. Um, his Golems push up now, after bringing through that wall, he's still got the jump spell in the bag. There it goes, right over that CC, allowing access to everything for his troops. Uh, and bowlers are pushing in, you can see six Valks still in the bag, and he's probably like, what the hell? Where are my Valkyries? Probably thinks they're dead. Little does he know, he's still got all six of them in the bag. You see two heals uh, still in the bag, and the Hogs are just coming in. They're going to go around there. Uh, good heal there, lots of, uh, lots of point defenses in that, and uh, well placed. Skeletons are going to come in there, trying to do a little bit of damage, but it's not going to be too much. Nothing that he cannot handle. And you can see at this point, he's just got um, he's got a couple bombs to get through. He's got the, that Tesla, that double Tesla there, wizard towers, and lots of point defense. The hogs are eventually going to peter out, and he's got six valves in the bag. We'll see what he does with those. See, hogs are actually going to take out the DGB. That's crucial. Uh, that saves his queen's life, and in comes six Valkyries from the bottom at this point. They're going to be going through that wall, picking up the Dark Elixir Drill, and just wrapping around the base. And we'll, four time, we'll two times this one. Sorry, guys. And you can see the Valks actually pick up the aggro of the cannon, and that's the saving grace on this raid. Um, Valks pull in, the wizard goes down to the bomb, grabs that hut, and the queen picks up the storage in the middle. Nicely done to Poppy there, uh, saving that attack after a little bit of a shaky start. Uh, next we'll be looking at, we'll take a look at number 9, taken being taken out by a tobacco here. Um, see, a little bit weak base wall wise and Tobacco is just going to exploit that by using those insanely powerful Valkyries uh, he's going to get awesome value from them and they're just going to tear up the interior of this base once they get in there uh, nice little queen walk coming in to start things off big dragon uh, it's going to grab three buildings misses that army camp because of the double archer tower there and uh, you can continue pushing into the base there it is, Queen walks down, she's going to pick up that mortar and that cannon and continue her walk, looks like she's actually going to go around uh, might path back up, no she's going to target the lab and that will be the end of her walk uh, continuing around that way and there he goes, you can see healers are going to be taken out by the air defense there as he wasn't able to walk into it got a nice spread on his Valks though as they come into this base they're gonna rip up that wall power right through that and they'll cause the king to reroute he immediately gets his jump spell down doesn't want all his troops going around the base and that's perfectly done there the heal spell coming in on the core did lose all his healers but the queen created an amazing funnel everything's gonna be pushing just the way he wanted right into that double giant bomb and the bowlers are perfectly tanked for hogs are coming in on the tank defenses on the top now and uh, Bowlers and King and Valks are working their way through the core. Nicely done here. And uh, this is perfect, exactly what you want. You can see the Bowlers in the core staying clear of those double giant bomb threat areas. And they're just going to annihilate everything from the inside of this base. You can see them hitting the town hall and spraying the uh, defenses on the back layer. Uh, one Valkyrie's outside the base with a couple wizards, and it's going to absolutely shred the exterior storages. And it's going to be awesome. Uh, great job to great job to uh, Tabacle. Um, awesome attack. You can see all his bowlers are still up. Some Valks, King, Queen. Just nicely done. And uh, this one's actually going to wrap up this war recap. So awesome job to the guys at Fight Club bringing home another win here. And I uh, hope you guys are enjoying the videos. Uh, subscribe if you are. But this has been Cree bringing you guys another war recap signing off peace